The economy is in flux, and businesses that are open, whether they have a couple employees or a couple thousand, are in some way at risk. I'm trying to figure out what we we're going to do in case there was a confirmed case on site. Jason Grant's team at Fleetwood Group is wearing masks and taking other precautions at their furniture and electronics facility in Holland Township, but they wanted to do more. Our electronics team was part of that discussion and came back and said, I, I think we can solve this. Weeks later, employees are wearing badges called Instant Trace. The small device tracks the proximity of one employee to another to monitor social distancing. So if you were wearing a badge and I approached you, your badge would flash red and mine would do the same thing. And it would be a cue to both of us that we need to be aware of our environments and may need to actually change our behavior. It doesn't track an employee's location, only when they're within six feet. Grant says the data can help companies respond more quickly to a positive case. Uh, it also may identify areas of your operation where employees are just too close and you need to figure out how to, to add more separation to keep everybody as healthy as possible. The technology has been vetted, but Fleetwood is still preparing the final product. They expect it to be ready for other companies in mid-May. We have a bunch of orders. We've got small companies, we've got um, large companies, plants with 3,000, 5,000 employees. Just one more weapon in a COVID-19 toolkit, which Grant says businesses will need long after the economy reopens. Until there is a vaccine that's available, I think every company is going to need to figure out how do you continue to keep your team members safe. In Ottawa County, Noah Fromson, 13 on your side.